get our next caller here on the phone line. Thank you for calling Iowa at the Voice of College Football. Who's on the line? All right, everyone from Iowa, sing it with me. Minnesota hats off to thee, to our colors. I did the people <laughs> firm and strong and united. Are we? Ra 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 of course. <laughs> hey, you're the best, brother. I thank you. I appreciate you calling yesterday because it uh, it changed the game. I have to say, my response was thanks, PJ, for calling in. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, uh, I, I needed to do that today for for you guys. All right. I am the happiest guy ever. Every time we beat Wisconsin, I'm I just happy to take one of the one of the two major trophy games. If it was in Iowa. Let it be Wisconsin. It's perfect. We congratulate you on your win. All right. All right. You guys have a nice night. I know you guys have some uh, Iowa fans that want to talk about Iowa yep. football. We got one more caller on the line. I think we're going to wrap her up. So I appreciate the call, Dave. Oh, okay. yeah. Okay. Bye bye. I love that. Dave called in yesterday before you jumped on yesterday, Don. And, uh, it's good to hear from him. He's from Minnesota and a happy gopher fan today. Vance, I don't yeah. think anybody, expected i mean very few people expected minnesota to win this game and i've never felt so involved and invested in an opposing fan bases game especially a rival like minnesota and it was just a beautiful thing yeah, let's take so a- at what point in this game this evening did you realize that we were west champions oh boy um you know i wasn't actually real comfortable until there was about three minutes left and then I decided, yeah, Minnesota's going to do this. So, yeah, that was pretty crazy. And, and it, there was no doubt. Back. I mean, this there was no doubt in this game. I mean, Minnesota thoroughly beat Wisconsin. Uh, this was not a fluke. Oh, um, yeah. First half was close, they, but the one touchdown for Wisconsin at first half was on a pick six. Minnesota's defense completely shut down Wisconsin's run game. I was, uh, I mean, PJ had... They had it dialed up. They 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 called and did the defense they needed to play. And uh, you know Tanner Morgan, the winningest coach at, in Minnesota history. I mean, I I feel good for the guy, even though I'm a born and bred Iowa Hawkeye fan. But I still feel good for that kid. I don't think he ever beat Iowa, but um, still, I mean, man, he's been through it all up there, I guess. And uh, you know, this is probably the if not close to the biggest win of his career, but I'll tell oh, you yeah. what, it put Iowa where we needed to be. And we're, you know, last week I was like, you know, if we win, we're going to, we're going to play Ohio state. And that's just kind of what I thought. <laughs> and, uh, then, then Michigan beats them. So I'm like, you know what? I, I think we match up a lot better with Michigan than we do Ohio state. So Absolutely. I'm, I'm pretty happy tonight. Absolutely. And let's be honest. I mean, we. I'm sure there were people out there that picked Michigan. I picked Minnesota because I kind of picked with my heart heading into the weekend. But let's be honest, if we were all picking with our heads, we would have picked Ohio State and Wisconsin. And that's the beautiful thing about college football. You never know what's going to happen. And usually it seems like, maybe I'm just a pessimistic fan, usually it seems like these are the games that don't go Iowa's way. And so I'm with you. It took me a long time tonight to finally realize and come to the realization that this was happening. And it's a beautiful thing. Uh, I'm I'm right there with you. I uh, was watching uh, the press conference after I was game and those guys, you know, they're just so calm and cool headed, but I just, you know, if I were standing there as one of those players, I'd be, I mean, you're rooting, you're literally rooting for Minnesota, a team you don't want to root for, but you know, it, it happened. And I'm like you, I was just a few minutes left in that game before I was like, you know what, this is, this is actually going to happen. I'm, Okay, but <clears throat> yeah, I just wanted to call and say, awesome, great show is done. You know, this was a this is a great weekend of football. Uh, oh man, you got, I mean, how about it? You know, you got the Nebraska debacle, <laughs> and that was Iowa winning the football game too, right? Right. But I mean, I thought, hell, you can't get any better than that. But then you got these two great games this today. I love seeing Michigan knock off Ohio State. And of course tonight. So I mean, well, wow, and I said it. Weekend. I texted Don Patterson during the Michigan Ohio State game, and and I know that so, obviously you're an Ohio State fan. You don't feel this way. That was one of the best games I've seen in years 
in my opinion. Just mm-hmm. everything about it. Oh, definitely. And it was chippy. And you saw the passion, and then you hear Jim Harbaugh with his uh, snark remarks after the game. You're right. This was a great weekend. <laughs> the weekend lived up to the hype. Oh, definitely, definitely. Now, I, I'm going to have one kind of questionable thing here with the Wisconsin game, which was okay. what was going on fourth and one, and you got Wisconsin's got the ball. You know, they've got to get two scores. It's fourth and one, so they're going to punt it. I've never, I've never seen. Quarter. I have never seen Paul Christ make with a with a I don't know what you call that. I mean, that was just a brain cramp. I've never seen him do that in in a game. I've never seen and Wisconsin then, do that. And and, and and then it's an illegal procedure, and he goes for it after burning. The and, and, and they get it. I mean, it's like and they the get heck? it. And they get it on fourth. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, that was yeah. wild. I mean, I, it's just. Well, I mean, hey, I just want to close with this. You know. We went out and everybody's going to say, well, Iowa, you know, you know, we won games really close and, uh, you know, we don't deserve and all this stuff. But here's the thing. We won the games this year. We are clutch this year. 